guys! So today I thought I'd do a Mythbusters and see if the egg and olive oil concoction that people put in their hair actually does improve condition. So I'm starting off with two eggs in a jar with a lid which makes things a lot easier for later on. And then next I grab some olive oil, well extra virgin olive oil that I had in the cupboard and I put in three tablespoons. Two, three. And then I was reading online about all these great oils and I was a bit annoyed because I didn't have any in the house already. But then I have one of our friends makes these really great skin treatments and they're all natural. And I was reading the back and it was saying how it had jojoba oil and argan oil and rosehip oil and all of these amazing oils that I was gonna go buy anyway already in this little tube. It's a face recovery serum, but I thought multi-purpose, we'll put a few drops in and see what happens. So I mixed it up and then, just to break up the eggs, pop the lid back on and shake it up. Doesn't look very appetising, but with all of the oils it actually didn't smell that bad. So now I'm just taking down my hair, just to show you what it was like before. It needed a wash, so it's not in the best of conditions but it's a good comparison to see whether the product actually works. So I just took my hair, got into some clothes that I didn't mind getting dirty and got a clip and a wide tooth hairbrush to try and get through all the tangles and get it all sectioned properly. Then next I grabbed our concoction, shook it up again and started sectioning my hair. I worked from my central parting down and that seemed to work for me. Oh, I forgot to take off my ring, that wouldn't be good to get all eggy and not very nice. Naughty naughty. <laughs> so next I got the different section, rubbed it in tried to massage it as it goes because I've heard that massaging your hair actually helps so I then sectioned the back bits after I did both sides of the partings and started working my way down once I'd done all that I put it all the way through to my end and started massaging because apparently that helps stimulate hair growth and I thought it might be helpful tied it up in a bun and then Victoria came home, so I started talking to her about what I was doing because she didn't realise I was doing this. So I was sat in my room with eggs and oil, it looked a bit suspicious. So I leave it for one hour, and I was thinking that my face was a little bit dry, so I got my facial recovery serum from Chili Bee, which is all naturally handmade in Dorset. And I've been to her workshop where she makes all the products and it's incredible. The room always smells so great, she does soaps and they're all natural and really great for um, eczema and skin rashes so that's always a positive. Whenever I come up in a rash I always head for my chili bee soaps and other chili bee products. Just chilling on my phone, waiting for the time to pass, left away a whole hour, although they say to leave it longer but I thought I'd do an hour just to not waste my time if it doesn't work. Brought up Chili Bee's website on Facebook. I really recommend that you check them out. It's a great company and the pictures are so great. I just like flicking through just to look at all of the great pictures. Oh. How beautiful are they, right? Sipping on my water. Maybe one time I can do a video and show you all about Chili Bee, that would be quite fun. So one hour has gone and I took out my hair and it's not smelling the best. So if I didn't have all of the great oils in there, I do not know what it would have smelled like. It would have been so bad. So now I wash my hair with lots of shampoo and a little bit of conditioner just to help detangle a bit. And it looks pretty good. It feels so soft. and. I'm actually pretty shocked with how it turned out. I think it went really well. So my hair is so soft and so like floaty. It's the best condition my hair has been in for a while. 
I just love it. I just keep wanting to play with it. Ta-da! Excuse the rather bare face. Wasn't wearing any makeup after the shower, so I look a little bit rough. But yeah, just put on my top that I had before, just as a bit of a comparison. The length hasn't changed at all, but I really think the condition looks so much better. So yeah, I do think it looks good. So like, share and comment below for any other videos and goodbye. Mwah.